What's up, everybody? I'm Damon. This is Nerd Notify, and today we're talking about Wonder Woman. There were a lot of great trailers that came out of Comic-Con, uh, Wonder Woman being one of them. This is going to be pretty awesome, and I think just basic uh, <laughs> feelings for the trailer are just really, really cool. So I'm, I'm pretty excited for this one. Wonder Woman is directed by Patty Jenkins and starring Gal Gadot and Chris Pine. No matter what, Wonder Woman has a lot riding on its shoulders, regardless if people want to acknowledge that or if they think it's stupid, whatever. It doesn't matter. It's a female-directed film about a very strong woman who can handle herself pretty pretty easily, no matter what the situation is. Um, what I'm hoping to see out of this movie is really more a, a lot more of Themyscira and just how how the Amazons have been this society on their own for so long. Like I, I'd actually rather see a lot more of that than what we've gotten out of this, and I'll talk about that in a second. The trailer opens up with Wonder Woman, Princess Diana, finding Chris Pine's character washed up on their shores. And of course, she's never seen a man before, so she's very intrigued and interested into who this guy is and what in the world he's doing there and what she can kind of learn about him and people, I guess, in general, men in general. From there on, it's just a quick shot of action, build up, a little bit of story build up, not much. I mean, really not much. The most you get out of this is that she is, for whatever reason, now, you know, outside of Themyscira on, in, in the world and fighting maybe Nazis. It looks like it's World War One again, so it's probably Nazis, which I don't want to get into. That probably is going to be the main action points are going to be from that. Um, but seeing it, like her in armor, moving around everything, like her outfit looks incredible. I think um, I think it just looks great. I, I like how the boots have kind of these, these um, I shouldn't say shingles, but the, it just the stacks of armor like running up her boot. Um, it looks amazing. The color on it looks amazing. Although this still falls into that same, um, I don't like to say historical something, but it's got that green kind of filter and backdrop to really show off the old like feeling, like to really show you, hey, this happened a long time ago. Um, that I'm not a big fan of, but whatever. It you know it is what it is. That's gonna happen. Her action scenes though, just seeing her in motion and fighting, showing her power, her speed, using her weapons, the lasso of truth, all those things actually look really cool. Um, I'm really excited to see where they go with this and just to see if she fights anything more threatening than just soldiers because that's that's nothing for her. I mean, there's this really cool moment where she's just standing there with the shield taking these shots from maybe a, I don't know, probably a um, howitzer or something, but that thing is just pelting, just and she's just sitting there just just beast mode in this thing with the shield and just looking epic so I, I want to see her take on something hopefully Ares that's what a lot of people think or something just something a little bit more menacing so we can really see her not struggle but just really show off the strength that the character has um, that's something that, that I feel is what brings Wonder Woman to the table makes her so special is her strength and how she has been taught one thing but values so much of humanity. You know, all life is valuable to her, um, no matter who it is, man, woman, child, doesn't matter. So overall, I think the trailer looked amazing. I'm really, really excited to see more. This was just obviously a quick glance into this world and there's gonna be so much more that happens. The comparisons will be made to Captain America despite what people have to say and you know the negatives that come from that, but it, that's just what happens when you come out second and you have this same warrior from another time who is eventually going to be brought into the modern it, it's it's just the same pitfall you run into no matter what um, i don't think that should be anything to be judged by but it's going to be something that casual goers are, are just going to make the connection it's just what's going to happen but i am excited i thought this was a really cool trailer i did like it a bit more uh, maybe maybe a bit more than the justice league trailer there are certain things in the justice league trailer that are really cool but there's some more in this that are more intimate story, a little bit tighter storytelling that I, storytelling that I think might just give it a leg up. Um, but honestly, we'll just have to wait and see. I'd love to hear what you guys thought. I thought the trailer was awesome. Please don't forget to comment below because I really do want to talk about it with you all. Um, thank you so much for watching. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe and share this with your friends and family. And as always, people, please don't forget to dance it out. All right. Peace.